The 39th annual Christmas dinner will be held in Oshkosh on Christmas Day. And they're looking for help with their annual meal. Emily Deem is live there with more. Hi, Em. <laughs> Good morning, Angie and Doc. Hi, everybody. You know, we're talking about making a difference, and what I've learned this morning is the Janess family has really been making a difference in the Oshkosh community. You know, they take care of Father Carr's place to be, this shelter out here. They give back to the community so much, 365 days a year. The entire family is doing this, and all of the volunteers that help out, and we are in their welcome center right now. This is where they have their holiday meals. We're on stage. This stage is set because Santa's coming out on Christmas Eve. You see all these stuffed animals right down below? Christine, can you tell me uh, where those are going and, and how much more you need of those? Yeah, well, we probably could use between 75 and 100 more stuffed animals. And these, what's here represents a lot of love all, throughout the past few months. People have gathered and collected and brought them in a few at a time to a bag full at a time. And as long as they can be new, they can be gently used, um, as long as they're in really good condition. And they really make a difference to the kids that come because I think every parent out there has had that experience where they want their kid to see Santa and be happy and take a picture and they cry or are afraid. And so our stuffed animals are one of the tools we use to help soften things and get um, children friendly with Santa so that they can smile and have a nice picture with Santa. And then they get to go home and have something to love too. I love that. And um, let's talk to Marty over here because you see the hat he's wearing. He is Santa's helper. What's it like on stage, Marty, and seeing the kids come up? Oh, it's fun. Uh, you get to hand out the stuffed animals all day to all the kids, and then I also get to help get them smiling for the picture. So. <laughs> that is just great. Joe, let's really talk quick about what we have on the table down here because you are serving food. You're handing out toys. You're, you're doing all this, so you need a lot of donations. We do. And, and right now we need some more hams. So if anyone is willing to go buy a ham, um, we could use that for our Christmas dinner. Um, and all the other fixings that go with it, the vegetable, any canned vegetables, um, any um, canned fruits, salads, your favorite um, treat that you like to make, grandma's old recipe for your Christmas dinner. Make a little extra and, and bring some over for us and we'll serve it here. And I love how Joe said that he feels like he's Santa and he has all of his elves that are helping him because they help out here at the shelter. They take care of it, but they really need you at home to come in and help. They need volunteers, whether that's drivers or servers, um, donations, people to help clean up. If you want to learn more, go to our website. Everybody, wave bye to everybody and say, hope you can join us out here. The Janess family, a great group. Go to fox11online.com. Yeah, Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. Happy holidays. Go, don't go anywhere. Good Day Wisconsin will be right back.